Come here.
today was something truly so Kidman, Julie, you've assembled quite the resume, I see. They taught you to read at the police academy? I'm impressed. Your attitude won't be necessary today. What is this place? Why am I here? You've been arrested, Miss Kidman. And you're currently being detained. I'm sure even you could decipher that. That's not what I asked. This isn't a regular interrogation room. They don't give you cushy chairs when you're about to be sent to lockup. No current address. On your own since 14, a runaway it seems. Quite impressive you made it this long without coming to your senses. If your street smarts are that keen, I'd imagine you'd have turned yourself around by now. It's more about survival. You think I'm pissed I got caught? At least I get free food in jail. It's all good to me. What if I told you that today could be different for you? You're a smart kid, you've got nothing to lose, no one to miss you. A person with those qualities could be open to very specific opportunities. What are you saying? You offering me a get out of jail free card or something? Not quite that, but something close. I'm listening. I'm afraid that the fragile mental states of the subjects are limiting our studies. Mobius wants us to move past beacon patients and onto more stable people. They want to get STEM closer to its intended use. Would they see the world in the same way? Would a sane mind weather the psychically draining experience? I had that dream again. I entered the STEM myself. Joseph, you're all right. You too, thank God. Any sign of Sebastian? Nothing. Maybe we can go back and look for him. No. I mean, let's just get out of here first, then we can worry about Sebastian. Can we open this gate? I doubt you and I are strong enough. <laughs> Joseph, watch yourself. I'll be fine. Quick, look around, see if there's another way out. We probably don't have much time. Look around for some way out of here. 